last, at last, the stage is set for an intellectual battle that the world will not forget. My opponent Moriarty, the epitome of evil, combines the ways of Satan with the habits of a weevil. I will need to summon all the many skills of my profession to be sharp as Moriarty's, to be sharper than a knife. In these very strange conditions, I have a very strange confession. I have never felt so happy in my life. For these are circumstances under which I thrive. A man so close to death becomes aware that he's alive. And Sherlock Holmes is very much alive. There's a panther-like spring in my walk. There is infinite charm in my voice when I talk. And I gaze at the world with the all-seeing eye of a lonely and high-flying hawk. I'm discreetly stylishly dressed when I look at myself I confess I'm impressed and in fact I would say that you see me today when I'm at my incomparable best I have manners befitting a prince I have flair without flourish and charm without chintz I adjusted my necktie at tea time today I have not seen such elegance since When they see me, they must be extremely depressed. I am tasting its peak, the quintessence of chic, when I'm at my incomparable best. Personality sparkle and poise, with a dash of panache and the minimum noise, are the wonderful weapons that win me the day in the war everybody enjoys. to suggest what discerning observers have already guessed that the culture of man becomes all that it can when I'm at my incomparable best when I'm at my very bright and merry legendary